What are you doing in my bed? Come off it. Come off it, Charles. What else does a woman want in her husband's bed? Woman, I've told you severally that what you seek in this room is over between the two of us. No white bird mingles with a dirty, filthy swine like you. What? Wait, you're blaming me now? Who else do I blame? Who else? I should blame myself. Why are you doing this? Can you look at me in the face and say it was all my fault? Listen, Charles, I did this for you. I crossed my boundaries for your sake. I did it for you to get to the top of your career. And instead of you to appreciate this, you turn around and want to blame me when in fact you are the one who is a very heartless man. Just get out of my bed. I give you my And my soul, I put my trust in you, never you let me down, never you let me down, my face is your face, I don't know if you see what I see, my face is your face. I don't know if you see what I see, but I'm giving you my trust. Oh, never you let me down. My only issue is this my Chinese people should just supply my goods. It's more than 30 days. <laughs> Doctor, I don't know what you're talking about. Is this heartbreak <laughs> of waiting for imported goods that has made me decide that I don't want to do imported goods anymore? I'm speaking to homemade goods, homemade Nigeria. Ah, I don't feed. Let me tell you, for me, eh, all I care about is my business. I don't care what the economy says, right? I'm a businessman. And I think every businessman should keep his business afloat for some impeccable people of beautiful taste. So it's our homemade goods that are not for people with impeccable taste. We're not homemade goods, so <laughs> or not homemade goods. All I want is to keep my business running, that's all. Hey, <laughs> forget it. <laughs> hey. Hi, you're welcome. Hold on, hold on. Sweetheart, food is ready. Can I set the table? Hey, I have to go chop up. Nonsense. Please, Jim, meet me outside. Going out. What was that about? Um, didn't. I'll talk to him. Okay. So, I beg, we need to, I need to talk to you about something. What? Look, don't be upset. It's not like uh, trying to meddle in your family affairs, but I don't appreciate the way you take talk to your wife just now. Come on, this is Vivian we're talking about. Vivian is the architect of whatever is happening to her today. Vivian, you know, is now a disgrace. Not the graceful wife I married. Is that serious? <laughs> My brother, let's talk about something else. I'm not interested in this gist. You can tell me to talk about something else now. This is Vivian we're talking about here. Your wife. I see. A woman who desecrates herself also ridicules her husband. Do you understand me? Do you understand me? You mean it's that bad? <laughs> brother, yes, sir. Can you imagine that I, I told her... 
She was supposed to just. Ah. Oh. Ah. Now, let me tell you. Those clothes, uh, uh, just dry them and I'll come and collect it. Uh, uh, sure. Some are ready, just meaning three. Yes, yes, yes. Clothes, it's clothes. He came to collect his clothes. He came to collect his clothes. Who was that? That's exactly what happened. This is exactly what happened. You know, Vivian. Come on. Vivian is, Vivian is a woman with pedigree, a woman with respect, a virtuous woman. Vivian will never do something like that. What, what, what came over okay. her? This is how dazed I was that same night she told me. Just the same way you feel right now. Then why are you still harboring her? I'm harboring her because I want her to be the nanny of my son. That's why. Jim, we need to find a way to sort this out. You, you, you can't continue to live on the edge like this. Are you still willing to have the drink? Well, I don't drink any beer, Rick. I'm not just doing it. You serious? Guy, you're on your own. Oh. We're going to have a drink right now. Give her a a game of chance, now you should play for Lanifo. Give and take a game of chance, now you should play for Lanifo. Holy, you should play with them. Seriously, Oliver, I do not understand why your father is treating me this way. Your father is treating me so badly. And yet he will not say his mind. I've tried so hard to make him talk, but he won't. He said you should ask me. <laughs> Listen, your father is the one that is treating me badly and I don't know what I did. He changed suddenly just like that for no reason. I, I don't even know the reason why. Maybe you should go back and ask him why. Listen, Oliver, you need to talk to your daddy, okay? I am seriously tired of all these allegations. They are very unpleasant. I, I can't take them no more. I'm sick and tired of them. Seriously. Okay. That's fine. That's fine. That's fine, my darling. Thank you. All right, my son, okay? Be good. <laughs> Mommy loves me too. Alright, thanks. We need to talk. There is nothing to talk about. Or do you want me to tell our son that his mother is a cheap whore? Okay. 
right? Same. Same. Uh, come in. Hi. Hi. How are you doing? Thank okay. you. Wow. Mm. Please sit. Thank you. <laughs> wow. Um, Thank you. Thank you very much. So, um, how have you been? Uh, I've been pretty fine. Wow, you look absolutely beautiful. I like your dress. Thank you. Um, you don't look bad yourself. <laughs> Would you like to go out with me for lunch? Absolutely. I mean, I would love to do more than lunch, but lunch sounds funny. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay. <laughs> yeah. Uh, <clears throat> I need to. All right. Please. Yeah. Good. Mm. It's quite tasty, you know. Mm -hmm. oh. You actually love the breast. The no. what? I mean, the chicken breast. <laughs> like this. No, I love the breast. Like, I really love breast. I know, I will. I hear you. I love the thigh. <laughs> It sounds wrong. I really so do you mind if I bring you in here for lunch? Mm -hmm. mm. So darling, mm -mm. you know I'm all yours all day, every day. Mm. Mm. Oh Lord! You can wake up now, Rico. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Lord. Oh, Lord. Oh. Hmm. Oh. Oh, okay. Okay. Chabe, chap, ma. This bad man. <laughs> <laughs> I'm, I'm wrong. I'll follow. Good man. Uh, <clears throat> do meet my queen of all queens, Maureen. <laughs> and Maureen, please do meet this naughty friend of mine, Jim. Hi, Maureen. Hello, Jim. <clears throat> I can't close my mouth anymore. Oh, why? Because you're not only beautiful, but elegant. <laughs> beautiful. <laughs> elegant. <laughs> Thanks for the compliment. It's not even knock. You know why? I've not seen him smile this much in a long time. Apparently, Aww. you're the reason. <laughs> tell her. I, I, I try. She's <laughs> you to tell her. Tell her. Tell her more. Tell her more. Tell me what? Just tell her. Tell her something about me so that she'll know who she's dealing with. I don't know what you want me to tell this beautiful one. But, okay. You see him? All you need to do is. Be careful, because he's a very sensitive man. I don't understand. Is that what I actually tell her? Oh, baby. I'm, uh, I'm a giver. I, I give everything. Give what? <laughs> Please let me have my own food. Okay. Okay.
Yeah. 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 Tunde. Yes, sir. How are you? Nice. Very good. <laughs> I take this back to the house. Oh, yeah. Sugar. Welcome to my house. Actually, <clears throat> this is my little mansion that I manage. I like it. You do? Mm-hmm. It's beautiful. Let's go in. Uh, hey. What? I mean, your wife. I mind them. It's no problem. Since the only girl. I'm telling you, it's no problem. Come here. Mm. Let's go. But baby, you know we can go to a hotel, right? We're going nowhere. We're going into my living room and straight to my bedroom. And we're going to misbehave. <laughs> you love it when I misbehave, right? You had me at misbehave. Mm -hmm. <laughs> <laughs> No, I'm not going to open it. Charles. <clears throat> Can I serve your food? I realize you don't eat from your poison pot. Huh? She will come here. Oh. No, we're not going nowhere. And I'm sure you're not going into that room. I'm in my room. Why? Do I owe you any explanations? Huh? If you go into that room, I swear I'll descend hell on you. Nonsense. I want you to descend hell and you yeah, know I'll bring heaven to you and give you hell. I only give hell to demons. Where are you coming from? I ask you, where are you coming from? It's been two days. Two days since you left this house. No calls, no messages. Listen, this house stopped. I cannot continue thinking. Listen to me right now. It is too early for you to be bothering me. Do you understand? You have lost the right in telling me what to do and how to live my life. Do you understand me? Charles, yeah, I don't think these steps you're taking are in the right direction. And every single time I want to talk to you about it, look, it bothers me. Why would you want another woman to play the role of the wife when you've got Vivian? You know, I actually allowed Vivian to stay back in my house for reasons 
best known to me. When I'm good with her, you will know. So you guys are filing for some kind of legal divorce or something? Don't worry, she will ask for a divorce when the time comes. There's no problem. I can assure you that. I just fear that this rash decision you're making will only lead to bigamy. <laughs> bigamy? <laughs> bigamy? <laughs> she will never sue me for such such nonsense imported idea. Look, this let me tell you something. Vivian will not want me to expose her dark side. Hmm? I think you should just stop flogging a dead horse. Period. Let's talk about something else. Come, Batman! Where did he go to? Come on, get me another drink. This man, I don't know what he's talking about. Give and take a game of chance. Now you need to play for Lani Give and take a game of chance. Now you need to play for Lani Deception, deception. I did see the game where you did play. Don't you say I'll be full, you know. All I'm playing is cool. I don't be full. I did see, I did see. The kind of game you play, you can never be wiser than the wisest. Take it cool. A smart will meet a smarter, and smarter will meet a smarter. My girl, she got a girl in her heart, and she gets one in her heart. And shed so much tears. Just because of a selfishness in this wicked world. Finding comfort in our ignorance, giving us safe emotions, not to break our heart. Why do we choose a wicked life when we should be good to one another? I truly believe in a good life, giving a beautiful life. Oh, to everyone and cause it's true. I don't want to, I don't want to lose a day. I don't want to in my life. I, I cry all day and night because of you. <laughs> oh, 
God. Tell the mechanic that he should look at these vents very well and he should check the AC. Uh, first of all, he should check the engine, make sure everything is working up well. Then he should make sure the AC is working. I don't understand what he did about this AC. Huh? Okay. Tell him that I don't because if I meet him, he will not like what I will do to him. that I don't have and I would want some money to buy them. Wait, wait, when did I become your ATM? Huh? So I'm now any time money? No, huh? sweetheart, please. I thought you know how to make money for yourself. Sweetheart. Yes. I don't like this. I, don't, I do not like it. It's taking too long. I, I mean, this wasn't the plan. I was just supposed to come here and, 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 and get a deal done and, and, and we'll move. I, I, I don't know, she went out. But I mean, all I'm saying is it, it's taking too long. And I'm tired. I don't want to be here. Okay. Look. We have a solid plan. All we need to do is stick to it and in no time. That's all you keep saying. Solid plan, solid plan. That's all you say. Every time, every time I try to talk about this, you say we have a solid plan. But can't you see that it, 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 it's taking too long? Babes, this plan is solid. And I tell you, that if it's the last thing I'll do, I'll make Charles pay. Charles will pay us. All you need to do is be patient. That way I'll give you that life you always wanted. But you have to continue doing what you're doing, which means sticking to the plan. Okay? It's hard, it's hard to tell you to be someone else. I know, I know. Come and give your sugar some sugar. Mm -hmm. I'm too tired. I'm going to play the part. Yeah, I'm not with now. you. Yeah, I'm not here all the time. Come on, come on, baby. Oh, will? There are things I want my husband to do for me, but I know he won't do them. But from now onwards, he must do them. And you must make it happen or else. <laughs> Nine the blade for life. Give and take a game of chances. 
This took me to plan. This close, we cannot afford to back out now. But this, this close, this close to getting what you and I want, and we can live the life that we want. Vivian? Vivian, your food is ready. Food is ready, okay? She does not know that we are talking about this. Morning. <laughs> yes? Yes, baby. I do not want to repeat myself. I don't want any affinity between you and Vivian. Do you understand? She's your rival and your enemy. Do you understand me? Yes. Yes. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to upset you. But that's what I've been trying to tell you. You know what? I took you over. We should get another place. I mean, you, you, you leave me okay. here and go to work, and I have to deal it's with you. Okay. It's okay. Hmm? I'll work on a solution on that. Hmm? It's okay. That's it. Sorry, things are not going well. 
I've waited for six months. Things are just not fine. I'm sorry, I have to live this way. I have family to cater for. I'm, I'm very, very sorry. It's okay. It's okay. <clears throat> Amongst all these staff members, you you are the you are the last amongst all of them, and you really tried. I'm really sorry. I'm really sorry. I've, I've not been able to pay your salary for more than six months. I'm, I'm sorry. I'm very very sorry, sir. Sorry. Out. Out to where? You didn't tell me you were going out. What exactly do you want from me, Charles? What? Sit down, walk around like you are doing? While there's nothing in this house, there's no food to eat. Look around you, Charles. Everything is going down the drain. Baby, I'm trying. Baby, what? You don't try hard enough. I need. I am going out to get some. Someone said, dog. Uh, Charles, this man here says that. I'm not taking my calls, Mr. Charles. Anyway, I'm here to inform you the stands of my institution. If you don't meet up with the due dates, we'll be forced to take drastic actions against you. No, 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 please, 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 please. I, I, I am doing everything I can to, to make sure I offset the debt. I, I'm even selling off my property and, and, and oh, please, please. When you talk to, talk to me now, please, please. Baby. I warned you. Oh, baby. You are a mess. Yeah, one second. Who's there? Are you, are you in the right place? Are you sure you are in the right place? Sure. Honey, it's me. It's your husband. It's your husband, Charles. Um, um, um please come in. Come and sit down. Thank <laughs> you. 
What can I do for you? Babe, I'm sorry. Baby, I'm... I'm so sorry. I... I have messed up my life. I'm... I'm so sorry. I... I didn't... I didn't mean to, I didn't mean to treat you this way, I swear, I, uh, I'm too sorry, please don't forgive me. It's, it's, it's time, it's okay. <laughs> um, after all, the experience I had with you made me a better person. Like, I am a stronger woman and a better woman now. I still live in this house. You didn't chase me away, so I guess I I have reasons to forgive you. So it's fine, it's okay. Please, can you sit? Please. It's okay. Forgive me. Here. Maybe I did. I I really want us to come back together. You, I, our son, you know, as a family again, I, I want us to be happy and again, I, I want us to be together in our home, our house, you know, running the stairs, wait, 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 watching wait, TV, wait, is do, 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 doing everything together. Wait, is that what all this is about? So you want me to just accept you back so that you can ruin my life again? After all you put me through? What have you forgotten? So soon. Okay, you know what? Let me take you back. Hold on, let me remind you. Mom, what happened? Nothing, darling. I'm okay. Mom, you look pale. Please go inside and rest. I'll finish the rest. Oh, darling, don't worry. Once you are done with all this, I can go in and rest, okay? It's fine. I'll... Okay, Mom. Mr. Adamson, your proposal is right here before me. You are supposed to come for an interview on the 6th of July. Yes. To stand before the committee and defend your project. Yes, exactly, sir. Okay? Yes. So we are going to be expecting you then. Okay? Yes, sir. Um, but, sir, what about the part where I have to fill the forms? Do not worry. I'll take care of it for you. Okay. Thank you, sir. <laughs> Thank you. My pleasure. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Mr. Adams. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Thank you, sir. Mom, are you okay? Yes, I'm fine. Mom, go and rest. 
give you, I cannot rest. The customers have to collect their clothes in the morning. And if they take the slides, that's it. You just have to finish and pack them then. Okay. The rest. Mom, mom, mom. Congratulations, Mr. Adamson. Thank you, sir. You are one of the shortlisted candidates for a project of such magnitude. Thank you, sir. Thank you very much, sir. You are welcome. Thank you, sir. Okay, um, you are to be here on Monday morning by 10 a.m. Okay. For a special briefing for all the bidding contractors, okay? Okay. okay if for any reason you will not be available, Ensure your representative is here. Sir, I, I'll be here, sir. I'll be here. I, Thank you very much. You're welcome. Thank you. Thank you, sir. Hey, yes, uh, hey, I walked from Brigadier Junction to Nava Road. Eh? All that way? Ah, honey, why now? You should have told me to give you some money when you were leaving the house in the morning. I have small money that would be enough for transport. You needed to be sure you people had enough. Oh. Sorry. Uh, my legs. Huh? No. You're supposed to be in school. What are you doing at home? I just got sent out of school today. You were sent out of school? Again? <laughs> Don't worry, eh? Don't worry, that one. I'll pay your school fees, eh? Yeah? You will pay. You pay. Um. Sincerely, I I don't know what to do. I don't know what to do. Yeah? Because there are six strong contenders competing on this project, and I don't even know how. And even three of them are women. That's the amazing thing about it. And this Donald guy has a way of favoring women, especially when he feels that they are disadvantaged. I don't know what's wrong with him. He should be very professional in the things he does. And that's the only problem I have with him. I think maybe you should, maybe I should hire a woman. Maybe I should hire a woman that can, you know, go with me. Sweetheart, what if I go? Why don't I go there and stand in for you? Why do you need to hire somebody? You don't need to hire anybody when I'm here. Let me go. Yes, let me go and stand in for you. He just said the man loves to favor women. He believes women should also hold high posts in the society. Especially when he feels they are being disadvantaged. What are we talking about? 
let me go there and present our case i will present it in a way that he will not even have a choice other than to just want to help me that's what i should do why do you need you don't need to hire anybody i'm here Oh my god. When you never thought of that, I swear. Like, I have a beautiful queen and... You actually forgot that you have an intelligent wife. Thank you, darling. And this bidding is in two days, so um, I'll have to give you all the information you need. Yeah. So yeah. you can defend everything. No, that's not a problem. We'll have enough time. Yeah. Right. Hopefully he will say, okay, I'll help, you know, mm -hmm. that will be it for us. I don't know if you see what I see, because I'm giving you my trust. Yes, Rosalind, please send in the lady I asked to wait for me. And please do not allow anybody to come see me. I am out, okay? Good. Thank you. Hey, Vivian, how are you? I'm fine. Have you seen? Very comfortable. Thank you, sir. So, how have you been doing? I'm fine, sir. I'm sorry I asked you to wait, okay? Because I needed to add, add, attend to some official matters. No problem, sir. Good. So Vivian, you see, um, the way it is, I'll make it plain to you, and then um, you make your choice, your decision. This project is 500 million men. Okay? And um, if you play ball, the business is your husband's. Okay? Not only that, this business is consistent for five years and if you play ball i can renew it everything ends here and starts here so deal is this i give you the contract and you give yourself to me vivian you can do this for your family you become billionaires if only you would just give me five minutes here and now and the contract is yours five years and then i renew it for you <laughs> baby first installment first installment 500 million naira <laughs> Just a moment. God. 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 Is this is this me? 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 Five hundred million. Five hundred million naira. How? How? Tell me, where do you want to school? Anywhere in the world, just choose it. Just choose it. Make your choice. Say it. You want to school in America? Make you will school in America. Our son will school in America. <laughs> Secondary school, your universities, your your masters, everything. You will actually live in America. So you're going to ask me where I want to go. Uh, what I want to be, uh, what do I want, what card do I want? Oh, because of the suffering you've gone through, it's enough. You have suffered too much. You will never work again. I will pay you salaries every month in dollars. That is my promise to you. You will re you will stay at home and take care of me. Just mention your salary for the month. And it must come in dollars. I promise you that. We will never see poverty again. Never, never see poverty again. This is a contract of, a contract of 25 years. 
This is the first installment. This one is just installment for us to start up. To start up installment. Hey. Are you happy? Are you happy? Uh, uh, wow. So I get to pay the dollars every month. No, no, no. Baby, what is the problem? Baby, baby, don't touch me first. Touch me. Don't touch me. Hi, what did I do? What is the problem? Did you actually sleep with Donald? Did you actually sleep with Donald? Yes, I, I did it for you. Yes, I just, I just not, not in that way. I just did it for Ross. Oh, like, you did, you did. I, 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 seriously, I don't know. I, I, I wish there was a better name for it. Like, what out of your mind? What were you thinking? What were you thinking? You did it for us. You did it for the family. I don't understand. The woman wakes up in the morning and defies her money, matrimonial bed, and she tells me she did it for the family. What kind of nonsense is that? Why would you do something like that? Why would you do something like that? Why would you why would you open your legs just because you think you wanted money? Why? That's not the reason. I did it for the family. You kept complaining. You were always bitter and sad. So I just thought we should. No. No. That's not the reason why you did it. No wonder you suggested that you you wanted to go yourself. No wonder you asked me to stay back so that you represent me. No wonder. That was why you wanted to represent me, right? On something you had nothing to do with. Oh, no. The legs were scratching you that much. I wasn't satisfying you enough. Oh, God. Vivian, I loved you. Vivian, I love you with everything I have. Oh. Our son, our family, you never looked at all this. Thank you. You went and opened your leg, you're so, you're so, you're so dirty. No! So no! Stop! 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 Don't you dare! Oh God. I mean it that way. I did it to save us. Not for the pressure of the next thing I had to wear him. If I say him tomorrow, I will not recognize him. Our son was not going to school. He hardly fits well. He eats once a day. You kept trekking for me not to post, looking for jobs. And I said to help you. And now you want to turn it back on me? How can you say that? I did this for you. Can't you understand that? Can't you? Did you hear how stupid? How stupid you sounded. My wife, the woman I married, out of love, did you hear yourself? You actually slept with someone in the name of getting money or whatever it is. For the family. Machine of you. I 
Let me do it. Ever. Don't do this. Why are you turning this all back? Oh my God. Simeo. Simeo, Simeo. Hey. You guys shouldn't have done this. See me, see me. My right has gone to one go. See me. Did I make a mistake? Look at me. What the Oh, I don't. Baby, I'm so sorry. I... I'm so sorry. I... I'm so sorry. I don't know what came over me. I... I was the one who told you. You did not hear it from anybody. If I did not mention it to you, you will not know about it till today. But I told you because I love you. Because I wanted to be honest with my husband. I told you because I was so guilty. The guilt was killing me. I had to open up to you. I did all this for our family. I did all this for you. But you used my weakness against me. And now, after I have picked up my pieces and I have tried to build my life back, you want to come back and ruin it for me again? No. Baby, I'm sorry. I, I'm sorry. I'm, I'm... Baby, I'm sorry. I... I don't have anything to do with Maureen anymore. I don't have anything to do with anybody anymore. I've learned my lessons. I, I promise to make you happy. I, I, I promise to, I promise to make you happy again. I promise to, that you will be my queen. You, you are my world right now. You're everything I, Maureen left me. Maureen left me because everything, everything went down and, Everything went down and I'm mine, 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 mine. <laughs> Oh my god. Are we knowing that those no wrong in your sight left you? Are you for real? Yes, this is just me a joke of the century. Yes, she did. She left me. Really? She left you? Oh, I'm so sad. And now she has you crying and crawling around me. Right? Hmm. Sorry, darling. But let me tell you something. Do you know that the so-called Maureen you used against me was the person that planned everything that happened to you? She planned with Jim from the very beginning to ruin you. Don't you have to continue doing what you're doing, which means sticking to the plan. Okay. But it's hard to tell you to be someone else. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Come and give a shot by some shot. Huh? Mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Just tired. I'm going to be here. Yeah. Yeah. Being yeah. yeah. with yeah. you. Here all the time. Oh, real? <laughs> oh well, I had to do what was best for me. I had to gather all I could, pick up one or two from here, so I can I could help myself. Yeah. <laughs> Baby, I'm so sorry, I swear. I'm so sorry, baby, please don't. I want us back. Please, baby, please. You're my world right now. Please, I'm not let you go. I promise to make you happy. I promise to do everything possible to make sure you're happy, I swear. Our son is not married. I promise to spend all my money. Our money on him, I swear. I don't understand you. Wait, do you actually expect me to forget everything it's me? Do you know how much you love me? <laughs> do you know what you <laughs> Now that I have gathered everything I could, I have tried to build my life again. Okay, yes, let me remind you of your exact words. A few years ago, 
You said, after all, you know how to make money for yourself. And now I have made that money. You want to come back and grab the money and ruin my life again, right? Please, please, no. No, please. No, please. Oh, please. Give and take. Give and take. 